G'day everyone and welcome back to Lockdown 3.0 Mail Time Part 2.0 Hey Robbie, you've got mail! You better check your mailbox! Okay Robbie, thanks mate. What's the address? Post Office Box 3006 Yoranga LPO Wangaratta 3677 Rightio, I've got three parcels from two people, so I'm going to do the, the one parcel from one person, one first, if that makes sense. I don't know whether that makes sense. You know, there's one thing that a sniper can't say to his wife when he comes home from holidays. I really missed you, because snipers never miss anything. <laughs> right, this is from Lachlan Goods. Feathers, we used to call these things feathers. All right, I'll show you the feathers. I'm not sure what they're called these days. We used to call these feathers. I'm not sure what the legality of the markers is. There's like six hooks. But yeah, hang it. And that might be two lots. Hang on, a little quick look. I'll have to take these out and have a real good look at them later on to see what they are. If they're the things that we used to call feathers, it was one dropper with a whole heap of these little hooks on them. We used to drop them down beside the boat at Lake Hume and catch like six redfin at once. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's a new style version of feathers. But we'll have a look and see what the letter says. And then I'll show you some of the pictures. Hi Robbie, my name is Lachlan. I really appreciate the time and effort you put into your videos. I would really like to meet you one day. I love fishing and yabbying. I go yabbying in the old dam down the road. Most of the time I would hit the jackpot and I would get 25 yabbies in one bait trap. There are some photos... Here are some photos of fish I have caught, and there is a little something else with this letter. From Lachlan, I am 11 years old. I'll put his, he's put his phone number there, so I'll uh, put my finger over the phone number. But how nice is that? What a wonderful letter. I love handwritten letters. Thank you so much, Lachlan. Let's have a look at some of Lachlan's exploits. 1.2 metre eel from his neighbour's creek. Wow. There's Lachlan fishing at, hangings, at Hanging Rock. My first fish I caught is this Murray Cod. Looks like a Murray Cod to me, buddy. Well done. My first ever redfin at Lake Belfield. I actually went to Lake Belfield once. I wasn't fishing. It's a beautiful, beautiful place. They are so awesome, Lachlan. Thank you so much. And if these are feathers, like I think they are, they're not, we used to call them feathers, but they might have a different name. Lift back, grab one of the swivels, gently lower the rigs down, caution, please handle with care, important, swivel, sabiki rigs. Yep, that's feathers, that's one rig with a whole heap of feathers on it, with a whole heap of lures that look like flies. You jiggle them up and down onto the boat where there's redfin and you'll catch heaps of redfin, sometimes you'll catch five or six at once. Thank you so much Lachlan. Do you want to see the size of this next parcel? I decided to do an online course. I've decided to do a, uh, a course in how to deal with disappointment and it's a correspondence course. I got my very first lesson yesterday in the mail. It was an empty envelope. This is from Zeppelin. Zeppelin Allen. Now you guys have seen Zeppelin send me photos before. Send me pictures and drawings. Well this, is, I don't know what Zeppelin sent me, but it is enormous. Let's see what Zeppelin's written. To Mr. Alexander. Hey you. Hi Robbie. How are you? Hope you're doing well. I'm doing great. One of your wicked view one of your wicked viewers sent me one of your wicked viewers sent me a package. I now have some new yabby nets and some wicked new lures to use. I got so excited when I got this letter and present that I screamed and an old lady at the post office thought my dad had smacked me. <laughs> I was so happy. Last week I got to go fishing with my poppy for the first time ever and I got to talk, I got to take my poppy to my favourite spot in Nara now. It was so cool fishing with poppy and dad. I got six fish, poppy got two, dad caught, dad caught beer <laughs> and poppy said I'm a bloody good fisherman and gave me one of his favourite old fishing rods. It's a Butterworth Supreme series and I have already caught fish on it. It is my favourite rod. On school holidays I wanted to try painting so my friend Tracy gave me a canvas and I did my first ever painting called, uh, called Inspired by Robbie. It took over a week to paint and I haven't 
and I haven't about and I learned about mixing paint and using brushes. I hope you love it. Thanks, Robbie. Be safe and watch your rods. <laughs> love your mate, Zepp. Zeppelin is such a cool young man. Now, how's this, right? Hey, you, I'm gonna read this bit out here. I'm doing great. One of your wicked viewers sent me a package and now I now have some yabby nets and some wicked new, new lures to use. A couple of my Patreons. A couple of my Patreons uh, got together and, and showed a bit of support for young Zeppelin. You may remember a while back I uh, opened some mail from Zeppelin and he wrote a letter that said that someone stole his yabby nets and he cried. Well, that really pulled at a few heartstrings and there's some really, really wonderful people on this planet behind the scenes that got together and sent a wonderful parcel down to Zeppelin. And I threw in a few additives here as well. Remember those lures that were sent to me from Trevor up in Wodonga to give away at my discretion? I've done a huge big giveaway. Well, there were still a few of them in a box here, so I threw half a dozen of them in as well. Zeppelin got the surprise of his life just before Christmas. Now, look at this. <laughs> That's a good thing I wasn't on my uh, motorbike when I went to the post office to get this one. God, Zeppelin, look, how good is that? Smells really cool too. Wow, we've got a yellow belly, a Murray Cod, and a Yabby, and Robbie Fishing. That is so, so, so awesome. And it's got Zep's signature on it. Zep, you're going to be an artist one day and this is going to be worth a lot of money. I can just see it. You are so, so, so talented. Wow. Now, Zep, I've got to tell you something. I like to keep a lot of my treasures out here, like my fork-shaped sticks and my fishing rods and stuff. But this is going to have to go in my house, so you may not see it in the backdrop of my videos. The reason being, this shed, in the frost, it condensates and water drops everywhere. And in the rain, water will run down the back wall there and it just leaks a little bit. I think this is just far too good an item to leave out here in the shed, mate. It's weathered, it gets very, very hot out here and steamy. And I think this one needs to go in the house, mate, and on the wall. Because that is just absolutely amazing. Have a look at that. Wow! Zeppelin, I'm so glad that you got that parcel before Christmas and I'm so glad that it put a smile on your face because I think that when I shared your story, when you mentioned that you cried because somebody stole your yabby nets, I think that pulled at a lot of people's heartstrings because the uh, the messages and stuff that I got from that were just, were just absolutely amazing. It restored my faith in humanity. You, Zeppelin, are an absolute gem. Thank you so much. All you kids that follow me and send me handwritten paintings, photos of your catches, is it just all fantastic? There's no words for it. Lachlan, that is so kind of you. Thank you so much for the feathers. That's, they're not called feathers, but that's the unofficial name. Thank you for the feathers, the photos, the wonderful handwritten letter. You kids are just absolutely amazing and you fuel my engine and keep me going. Thanks very much for watching everybody. I hope you've liked this video. If you have, <clears throat> if you have, why not give it a big fat thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and then hopefully I'll see you in my next video.